What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Monique and we have a completely different setup and that's because for the next couple of weeks we're going to be doing something different and if you guys like it, I'll probably carry this on once we go back to the normal cash envelope stuffings of my sinking funds. But I did create these um, mini envelopes and I wanted something small because I carry a small purse. Uh, my son has a severe allergy to peanuts so he has an EpiPen and I have a medical condition where my body basically goes into anaphylactic shock randomly so I have an EpiPen so keeping a small purse and a clear way to get to the EpiPens is the best thing for me so I created these small envelopes to go in my purse so I could take them to the bank I am wearing my Sun's Out set from my Etsy shop. I am going to link it down below, but I was not kidding you guys. I am obsessed with this set. So I did take from the sinking funds envelopes and they are going to be refilled once my husband's disability comes through. My husband is a welder. I've mentioned it before. But basically when we got COVID, he started developing some serious issues with his lungs where he was having trouble breathing. And as a welder, you inhale a lot of smoke so he wouldn't be able to go back to work for about three months. And he's going to have to get a lot of testing done to check the capacity of his lungs. So we have money to cover our bills and expenses for the next, I believe, month and a half. We do have more money aside, but we're gonna just work with the month and a half that we have. I'm gonna count how much we have to work with, and I'm sorry if you could hear my dishwasher going in the background. Hopefully it's not too loud, but we're gonna count how much we have. So we have one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have one thousand. One, two, two hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, three hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, four hundred, twenty. 5, 30, 5, 45, 45, 50, 5, 60, 1, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66. So we have $1,466 that we're going to be working with. So I am going to separate the bills so that we can... We're basically going to be stuffing um, our bill envelopes. So for the next couple of weeks, like I said, we're going to be stuffing bill envelopes instead of just sinking funds. So this week we have our phone bill coming out which is 205, our internet coming out which is 80, streaming services which I believe is only Netflix is coming out and that's $14. Then we I'm sorry, let me move this so you can actually see it. Then we have groceries and usually we do 150, but we're going to try to do 100 if we do more then it's fine we'll just add it but the goal is to do a hundred and then gas is getting its usual twenty dollars so i'm gonna pick up the envelopes that we need we're gonna be doing internet we have credit card car payment groceries streaming Insurance, uh, Apple, this would be um, Apple Music and the Apple Storage, Gas, and 
phone. And then the other ones I'll put aside. I did want something that was very clean looking and neutral. So I did make these myself. So for phone, we're going to be putting $205. So I'm going to get 200 and a five and then one two five and literally you just roll it up and put it into the envelope and that's literally it next we have internet and internet is going to be getting eighty dollars so we're going to do 20s. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80. And these will just go into our bank account because we do just have them take it out of our bank. But I wanted to keep the cash here so that we are able to see how much we have and what's going in and what's coming out. Internet has $80. Streaming is going to be getting $14. So I'm gonna do two fives and four ones. One, two, three, four. So if you guys like this, where I'm showing you guys what bills we have and how much we're taking for the bills, let me know down below in the comments and um, I'll incorporate it once we go back to our sinking fund um, cash envelope stuffings for Thursdays. Or maybe I'll just do this as a separate video for, um, I'll do like two videos a week instead of one video a week and one will be for bills and then the other one will be for sinking funds. So. Just let me know down below if you're into this. Also, um, I know that with COVID going around and it's been around for the past year, that a lot of people have, uh, you know, struggled with their health and their finances. We've never applied for anything like this before. And I'm not sure what the waiting period is or how long you have to wait before they actually deposit money into your bank account. So if you have been through this, I'm sorry that you had to go through it, um, but maybe if you could let me know how long it took or if you've heard of someone doing it, just let me know how long it took down in the comments. Because like I said, we've never done this before so we have no idea. Next is groceries and usually we spend 150 but we haven't been spending as much as we usually do. I almost took 200. So we're gonna do 100 instead for groceries. And I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like in my purse because I love how simple it is. I love how sleek it is. It doesn't take too much space. It's like the perfect size. And I do, I, I have bigger bags but I prefer to use my smaller bags because I feel like with bigger bags, there's more clutter. So just so that I have easy access to the EpiPens, I just keep a small bag, keep it clean. Gas is going to be getting $20 for the week. And we have been taking the kids to... Um, so like just go out and drive. Since COVID cases are still going high in our state, we have not been traveling um, to other people's houses or you know visiting anybody. We pretty much just go for drives with the kids so that they go out and then we'll take them to our backyard. But um, even though we did have COVID, there is a chance of reinfection. So we don't even travel anywhere. So. 
we pretty much just hang out in the car so gas is definitely a must because we like to take the kids out so this is my bag like i said i keep a small bag i have my wallet and it's not a big wallet like i said i like to have small easy things in my purse and then i have our epi pens so with these being so small i'm able to just grab them and i will put them in the little pocket that's here and they are in the pocket now so i can just take them out and put them in easily and i still have access to the things that i need on the bottom thank you guys so much for watching again my set is on my etsy shop and i'll be linking it down below they are completely customizable all you have to do is message me i have already um customized two sets since opening my etsy shop on monday and you could change the cut the color the length the design that you want so i wanted to make it as personable as possible i hope you guys enjoyed today's video i will be posting again on thursday so stay tuned subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out feel free to comment down below so i know if you guys enjoy this or if i should just scrap it all together I'll see you guys next week. Bye.